Hello and welcome. This is new ABAP on HANA. This is a series of course that will revolve around ABAP and HANA. What we will be starting with? We will be starting with basic CDS, how to use CDS. We will be covering it in a perspective that if you are a beginner in this new technology spectrum, then you are not facing any challenges. We will be keeping the learning curve very gradual. So it starts with slow and slow exposure to this new frameworks technology, how to use CDS to use an ABAP as AMDP, how to use CDS to expose this for Fury application, how to build Fury application entirely using CDS data or expose the data of CDS and only use those in your Fury application and use data not only for transactional type of application, but also analytical type of application. We will be keeping our focus on the new horizon of technology by also covering the cloud platform SDK for S4 HANA. We'll be also looking into how the cloud platform integration work when you have multiple system span across cloud and uh, you want to basically create an application which utilizes data from multiple different different clouds or different different stacks. How to do that? we will be using the cloud platform integration application there we'll be also adding the abap 7.5 update there's a new features there's a lot of new feature in abap 7.5 it's not just a mere small update but it comprises of multiple updates and those updates are making the new development with cds views or hana possible what are those updates what are the features in ABAP 7.4 which you should be aware about when you are trying to deliver project or you are a consultant and we will be also covering the new SAP HANA XSA the XSA stand for HANA XS Advance now this is a new HANA systems where you will be able to run microservices so we will go inside this HANA XSA and we will see what are the possibilities how to use it for productive application you see all the features it provides and uh, when it comes to application development as a consultant or developer what will be the particular scenarios or settings or technical aspect which you need to master to be able to work with and access a we'll also have a separate brf plus which was requested by some of our users brf plus is more like a lego blocks which is used to pull data together as a workflow we will be also seeing that now all this in this new abap on hana course this is going to be a series of course which we are going to start from today now i hope that this abap on hana series of course or what we call as a bundle as well will transform the way you work in industry and will help you in coming few years where ABAP and HANA is going to be taking center stage and we have a lot of new technology, new stacks, new way of application development, deployment and also design, not to leave design aspect. And I hope that the ABAP on HANA will be allowing you to transform your skills to match up the new age of demand coming up with the new ABAP and HANA and all the technical stacks what we have. If you want to learn and upgrade and are really want to learn the best way or get the best experience, then I highly recommend your new ABAP on HANA exclusively on UI5CN only. My name is Ajahn Ike and I will be instructing a lot of courses in this new ABAP on HANA and I hope to see you in this course. Learn simple.